This is John over at Flea Flicker Sports, and today we're actually going to do a review of our site. So we want, for full transparency, we wanted you to understand exactly how we rate and review each of the sports books that we decide to put on our site. Uh, there are many that we end up putting aside and we don't put them in our ranking. Uh, we only put the ones that we've put through the grinder, if you will. Um, and so there's a specific way that we do it. So if I go actually even right now back to the home page here and then I mouse over sports book reviews, all right, I'm going to go to the category in general. Even though we do have drop down, we have more reviews of different books underneath it. What I want you to pay attention to is our rating process. So some books don't even make it past the first phase. The first phase is reputation. What is the reputation? Now, there's good and bad. There's no perfect sports book or online casino. I'll be the first to admit that. But there are good ones that have come a long way, that have learned. They've brought in new management, new leaders, uh, new philosophy uh, as far as customer success and, and really how to treat customers properly or be obsessed. So basically, we have a section there based off of reputation, and we go dive deep into the forums, uh, we talk to different people in the industry, and we get and, you know to see where they stand as far as reputation. We review their banking and payments. We make deposits with different methods, credit cards, crypto. And we, if we have some money and win it, we attempt to make a withdrawal as well. We review the bonuses and promos. We often update their bonuses and promos as they're updating them as you go throughout the year. Uh, but we also compare them to see, are the rollovers fair? Are they too high? Is there any issues? Uh, there, uh, but we go into that in depth as well. We love going into customer service to understand better, you know, what is their philosophy? Do, what, are they open to all three different channels? Can you call? Can you uh, contact them via chat? Can you send them an email? And how fast does it take to reply? So we get into the customer service and we rank them there. Site compatibility. We like to look and see if the site is compatible on all different devices. We test them on iPhones, we test them on Androids, on tablets, on laptops, on desktops, uh, all different screen sizes to make sure that the customer side is good and where it should be. So we wanna be customer obsessed. And then finally, we give a ranking on overall experience. This re this is done in any of the reviews. I can randomly go to Bet Online here for a second, and I can show you that this is the same format you're going to find on any casino or sportsbook review that we do. We have the final score here at the top. We have a table of contents, and if you wanted to, you can, for example, you can jump right down if you wanted to go to banking and payments, and it'll take you right to it. So you have that ability right here in our table of contents to get to where you want. We talk the pros and cons. We get together as a team after we've reviewed each site and we look at all the good and we look at the bad and we give the feedback to each company on the ones that we think that they can improve upon. And again, we hop right into the review here, more in depth, a lot more uh, content here for you to see. We have a section with best casino games. This section is basically where myself or the team is updating and doing a review on specific games, whether it be blackjack, whether it be a new game that's launching at a specific site, or even an old game that we wanted to review. We have a banking section that we talk about the ways to deposit with credit cards, casino payment, crypto payments, and get your money out fast. We have betting strategies. Tons of selection of articles and content on how to bet, whether it's football betting, casino, any sports betting, and then online poker. And then finally, we have a betting news section where we update daily uh, current news in the sports world. So that's basically a site uh, review. We do have as well uh, our social media. We have about, I don't, I'm not sure how many videos now on YouTube, but we're constantly putting out new videos on YouTube for you to review. Uh, tutorials, sometimes they're game reviews, they vary. Uh, so if you like this video, if you felt it helped you, uh, I wanted you to see the, I wanted to be transparent uh, for me and the team over at Flea Flicker Sports uh, for you to like it. So if you liked it, give us a thumbs up and uh, hit subscribe in our YouTube channel as well. And I hope you have a great day. If you have any questions, you can write to me at support at fleaflickersports.com. Take care.